This is the galaxy I'm working on, and that's why you strip all the stuff off, because you want to see what's going on, so this is what I'm going to do today. It's Friday. Um, I don't know what you would do, and I've thought about it, you know, that's a lot of patchwork. That bronze gone down there and folded under. I got a bunch of bronze work here and folded over. The lip is really thin here, and you got a patch that's beat in here with a hammer, right? Hit the hammer just beating on it, right? And uh, I'm, I'm, I wish I could have showed him the easy way, you know what I'm saying? He probably worked quite hard at that to get that all welded in there and beat that all up and get the rivets out and all that stuff. This is what I would do. I just build a whole quarter panel. Let's do that. I'm going to take a piece of tape. I'm going to take and build a quarter panel up to here. I'm going to make the whole thing. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. I'll show you. This is what we're going to do. I'm going to take this line off right here. And I'm going to tape some paper to this line. I'm going to make the quarter panel up to this line. This is all worked up anyway. Someone had a bronze, you know, had the bronze torch on it, right? They've, they've worked it. Not saying, they, not saying anything about it, you know what I'm saying? Because you just never know what he paid to have that done. You don't know if he wanted a certain amount of money. You cannot down somebody if you do not know. So if you say someone did a bad job, well, they might only pay $50 for it. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, this is, this is the case right here. I'm going to make a quarter panel with this car, and I'm going to show you how to do it. This is all gone. The lips are all gone. Down here is gone. I got a hole down here, so I'm just going to make it from a quarter panel from that line all the way down. Piece of pest. I'm going to take a piece of paper. Here, Taz, give me a hand for a sec, will you? This is Taz, my uncle. If you haven't figured out why they call him Taz, well, you'll figure it out after a while. I just want to hold that piece of paper up on this line right here. I'm just going to take this piece of paper. I'm going to take it on this line. You can pull it down a little bit, okay, if you want. Right here, a little bit here. Actually, I want the, the paper right tight up with the tip. Like that? No, actually, I want it right down on the bottom of the line. There you go. Exactly. And I'm doing that for the reason is that is where I'm going to cut. That is where I'm going to cut when I take this paper off my pattern. But that is where I'm going to cut the quarter panel off. Then I'll, when I make the quarter panel, I'll make a, like a 45, whatever that is. I'll bend it in the break and bring it up. And maybe I can weld it right on that seam. And I can grind it off real nice. You never even know we put one on it. If, you know, if we take our time and do a good job. If you keep that up a little higher. When you pull that up, just pull the paper up. Don't matter if yours is fitting or not. Just pull it up. Pull up a little higher. There you go. Down. Down. There you go. Perfect. A little bit. Perfect. So I know right now where I'm cutting that off because when I pull that tape off, it's going to stay with the paper, the tape is, but I'm going to cut it off at the bottom of the other tape. So I already know where I'm cutting it off. So what I'm going to do with this quarter paper, this paper is, you can see what I'm doing right now. I've got to shut that door, it's right. It. I know I might do something to the light, but it's right. It. So this is my, what we call my 3D printer, is the paper. You know, I'm 3D printing this quarter panel with a piece of paper. So I'm going to take that underneath there. What I'm going to do is hold that on. And I'm going to trace the whole quarter panel out. I'm going to hold the paper down tight. I'm going to trace the wheel out and everything. Why don't you give me a set of hands on there for a sec, Taz? Hold that down. Sexy's a lot more prettier, but we just, we got to have her holding that. The goods, right? She knows what she's doing. We don't. I just want you to hold this quarter panel and this paper in tight on the in tight on the quarter panel all the way back. Just make sure it's tight and just keep it there, okay? Just keep it tight. Don't rip it or anything. We're just keeping it tight. We're gonna make the whole quarter panel by tracing. You know what I'm saying? By tracing. Nothing to it. Now, when I make this wheel well, I'm going to try to fold that paper down in that little gully so I have the right read. If you don't do that and pull straight down, well, then you're not going to have the right read. You know what I mean? If we're 3D printing, we got to get the right read. I'm going to 
have to add a piece of paper on this side, which is not a problem. And I'm thinking, when I go through this, that is my lip, that is my outside lip. So I have another lip that goes here. And I'm going to draw my own lip on because remember they had it thin and thick and all that stuff. So I'll come along here after and lay this piece of paper down. And I'll draw my little lip there. It's supposed to have like a little square lip. And what will happen is, is I'll take this piece of paper, I'll transfer it to a piece of metal, like always. I'll make my piece of metal. I'm going to cut this in half because I haven't got anything that's eight feet. I'm only four feet and it's too hard to handle. If I had, you know, bigger equipment, more people, like let's face it, we could just take an eight foot sheet, put it through the roller, trace the wheel shape out. This little body line here we'll do with the, with the step roller because it's got a little body line there. We're going to put a little step roller there for that body line, which I'm going to trace out right now. Put this down here. I'm going to trace that line out. So I know exactly where that, I'll just use a step roller on that to give me my body line. We can come down here. Oh, it's already open. I love this place. I want to mark that in my thumb. Just put a little pressure on that. Tells you exactly where that is. You know? No guessing at all. It tells you exactly where it is. No guessing at all. I'm going to have to add a little bit of paper to the bottom of this to get the rest of this piece. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this piece of paper and I'm going to cut it in half. Now it'll be two pieces, two sections I'm going to have to make. This piece right here, this little lip, and the, and the 90 goes under. I will cut a piece of metal. It's a four foot strip on a piece of metal. I'll cut it the whole length. I will bend it in the brake into a 90, and then I will use the shrinker stretcher to make this, this here and in. I'll make the shrinker stretcher to make all that fit, and I'll butt weld it to my quarter panel. The, the lip that rolls out like this, when I get my metal done, when I draw my picture, because I'm going to draw a picture, remember I'm a 3D scanner, I'm going to come up here and I'm going to, I know, right around here, all the way around that quarter panel, it's got a lip, a lip that flares out. When I make this panel, I will dolly it all nice and flare that out before I weld this to it. All right, I got some work to do.
for the panel all welded up. I took this piece right here where it's all folded out like that. When I had it without this wheel up on it, I just took a hell of a dolly here and hammered it up all the way along. Sexy was in the house, I was out here, you know, things happen. Anyways, what I did is I just took a marker and drew that on there and just held my dolly and flipped that up. Then I made this wheel lip, or this, this here wheel lip here, I made it to that quarter panel so I know it was the same. So this is what it looks like on the inside of the quarter panel. Watch it, sexy. Well, that's kind of burn up a little bit. You can see how it's about well together. This is a 1965 Ford quarter panel. You can't buy them. So I had to make it. And I will not leave stuff like that in the car. If you want to grab the other side, we'll set that up there. And, uh, you know, that's sort of what it's sort of going to look like. You know what I'm saying? We're going to replace all that, put a new sheet of metal in there, and be really happy with it. My daughter, Harley Hiltz, has a fight tonight. I'm her number one fan. We may go live tonight at 7 o'clock. The Hiltz family. Fight night, the Hilt family. Get her, Harley, get her. Have a good Friday, everybody. If I can do it, you can do it. I showed you how to do it. Playing with paper, you'd think I'm crazy, wouldn't you?